This is an excerpt of a recent Power Up webinar looking at the new features in Premiere Pro CC, the 7.1 release. Adobe calls freeze frames, which is what I've called them since I was doing production, calls freeze frames hold frames. Some people call them still frames and freeze frames and hold frames. The problem is I want right, I'm going to use the arrow keys, just before her foot hits the ground right there, I want to have it freeze at that moment so I can put some graphics on this side of the frame. Well, normally we'd have to export and import and shoot still frames and, oh, too much work. Right mouse click on the clip. Scroll about halfway down. See where it says insert frame hold segment? Okay, what happens there is it automatically creates a freeze frame. Freezes and picks right back up again. Does an insert edit with the freeze frame. If I select the trimming tool and trim, I can make the freeze frame any duration that I want. Gone is that default duration. I can trim this to be any length that's necessary to have it be the effect that I want to have it be. Well, this is really cool. I'm just going to undo that to get me back to where I left off. But we can do more with our freeze frames than just simply insert something. Say I've got a clip and I want to freeze this shot right there. That's the shot I want to freeze. Go back to here, right mouse click on the clip, and this time says add frame hold, and it freezes the shot at the position of the playhead for the duration of the clip. So now when I play this, she's running and freezes, and the rest of the clip has been replaced with that freeze frame. I can still grab it and trim it and make it whatever length I want. But the cool thing now is I can do an insert and have the action stop and then restart, or I can freeze the action for the duration of the clip. Well, let's just reset this. Okay, there's our shot right there. Right mouse click, and this time I'm going to select frame hold options. What frame hold options allows me to do is this allows me to create a freeze frame at, the, at that time that goes from the playhead to the end of the clip. Or I can create it at the end point or the out point or the position of the playhead. I'm going to create it at the in and click OK. Watch the image in 2, 1, woof. Not quite the same image. Her foot has hit the ground. And the entire clip is a single freeze frame that lasts for the duration of the clip. Normally, she'd be running. But here, with the freeze, she's frozen based upon the in, the out, or the position of the playhead. This has been an excerpt of a recent Power Up webinar looking at the new features inside the latest release of Adobe Premiere Pro CC. For the complete version of this online training, please visit our store at larryjordan.biz slash store and look for Webinar 113. Thanks. Membership is a great way to stretch your training dollars because a subscription membership to our video training library saves you money. Access all of our videos for one low monthly price of only nineteen ninety nine. That's more than 600 movies, dozens of hours of training, all in-depth and all up-to-date. Plus, members can attend any of our Power Up webinars for free. Our training covers Apple and Adobe software. We update it every week. And for more information, visit LarryJordan.biz slash subscriptions.